Well, hey there, Bell Mathewin here, bringing you another Let's Play episode in our Survival Minecraft 1.13 series. Today, we're taking care of that potato and carrot farm that we started, that we did a couple of episodes ago. Because I'm kind of sick and tired of going over there with joker boxes and trying to unload like 12 or 14 double chests full of uh, carrots and potatoes into shulker boxes just to bring them back all the way over here. So I'm thinking we're going to make a shulker loading system here. It's going to load them, it's going to pop them off into a double chest, and then we'll have preloaded shulker boxes to just run over here, grab, and go over there and trade. And I think I can make it fit in this little panel right here. Because, yeah, we're not going to use anything really off the back of here. Actually, maybe. You know, we're going to do it right here. It's going to load right into our uh, storage area. So, I think we're going to have to empty this area, this frame out, at least temporarily. I just spent a couple of hours in creative trying to figure out how we're going to do this. I came up with a shulker unloading system of my own. And uh, I think I can make it fit in here. If you're interested in the full tutorial, me derping around in creative and coming up with the system, you know, go ahead and check it out. It's on my channel. But for now, I'm going to go ahead and make a nice little empty box for us to build in and we'll meet up right after that so i think i may have dug out enough space and i think i may have come up with the plan we can't go any farther that way anyway and uh we have all the room we need on this side so i'm thinking a hopper chain underneath some soul sand coming up to these two chests and then I guess above them or around here, I can put chests for the other types of food because uh, those two chests will get full fairly quickly by the end of the season. So we started off with this hopper chain, the soul sand, and the shulker chest, or the shulker box for both sides. That way we can kind of plan the rest of the build out around it because we're going to have an impulse SV sorting system that leads down into these hopper chains into the chest and from there we start working on our uh, that's where we start working on our uh, shulker smashing system All right, so let me play around with this a little bit. Uh, let me grab some more trash blocks. I got plenty of those from digging the whole place out. So let's see. I guess first we're gonna figure out what kind of sp what kind of space it's gonna take us to build the shulker smashing system that I came up with. So I believe, yes, it goes just like that. Or no. So we're gonna have to move this hopper chain and this hopper chain. Because we're gonna want that and that. We're gonna come out the comparator there. Alright, so it's going to look a lot like that. So those two. Comparator there. Yep. Or no, comparator there. Redstone block there. And then... Yes. So 
that block can go away. Ooh. And that can get lit right up. That could have been bad. Okay. One more there. And I did not grab dispensers. Uh, two of those. It's going to be so nice not having to run over there and fill shulker, shulker box after shulker box from the potato and carrot farm. That got old really quick. So let's see. Let's see if we can drop down a level. Okay. Yep. So dispenser facing into each one of these shulkers. We're going to want comparator facing out of the block. Oh. Out of the block that touches each of these shulkers. And then we're going to want two redstone repeaters on full delay going into the dispensers. I'm kind of building this, I'm kind of reverse engineering this, just so that I make sure we have enough space for the shulker loading system and then we can kind of, we can kind of do the impulse SV sorting system wherever and just run it, run it into the topper chain. All right, so I should actually do this with stone bricks so that it stands out so I know which ones not to remove. Yeah, let's do that. Because that's pro tip there. That's a very good way to make sure that you're not going to destroy something that actually has redstone on it. If you're digging at it from the side or you know, three months from down the road you try to do something to the system or around the system. Okay, so there's the two repeaters, the redstone bit. Two repeaters, redstone bit, redstone block, and one more coming off. I think that'll do it. Full delay. I can't even begin to tell you. How it, it, I've been playing with this for quite a while now. Uh, between the creative build and uh, doing a tutorial on the creative build and then trying to make it into reality in the survival world here. Uh, in survival mode and in restricted quarters it, uh, it makes quite a difference all right one more block right there let's get these out of our inventory so those should go there and there I need some half slabs I should have a crafting table real close by that should be enough. Alright, so we want there. Remove this one. And then there. there so they come back over the comparator and redstone dust regular block redstone repeater redstone repeater and pick block some dust on there on that block and on the two half slabs 
and those go into no <laughs> those go into sticky pistons and I didn't have enough slabs these ones I want to be a little bit more decorative Ooh, we got a thunderstorm going on outside all right yeah that should be the whole system built Now the question is, how do we get these hopper lines to somewhere back there? Hmm. do the sorting system right back here. I may actually have to dig out a little bit more space. And grab some more hoppers. Ooh, the old lady is making some buffalo chicken wraps she's had going in the crock pot. My stomach is going nuts. <clears throat> Looking forward to that. So we should be able to fill this in, that, that, and that. Uh oh. Okay, I can get out. <laughs> you know how many times I've trapped myself somewhere doing redstone? Way too many times to be willing to admit the number. Uh, let's grab these out very important with this build to uh, fill in all of the empty spaces so let's go ahead and stack up here because we have double jump which is a beautiful thing so let's go actually no we'll fill in these afterwards We'll go ahead and fill in this side, though. And those are a little bit more expensive. Can I climb? No. <laughs> yeah, we're going to have to make sure that it's properly lit up back here after the fact. So right here, or no, right there, we're going to do a stair block. Uh, where, ender chest, ender chest, quick, quick, ender chest, uh, project box, a little bit of food. There we go. So we're gonna go like nope. Well, we'll leave it there for a second. And then remove these. Uh, did I get any in the shelters? I guess I didn't. Nice. Yeah, I'm in uh, super concentrate mode because I want to get this done right. A little bit of green glass. We don't have any, do we? There we go. We don't have a lot left, but we've got enough for this. Two, three, four. There and there. And then 
Actually, you know what? We don't need to do it there. We can just go here, here. Oh, stone brick. Let's not waste our concrete right now. Yeah, just like that. And that allows us to get up here and check on our shelter box if we need to. And that soul stand is in case it pops anywhere else. Uh, like right here under the hopper. It'll still get sucked up. So let me uh, play around with finding a little bit of space for the sorting system that we've already used a couple of times in this series. And uh, then we'll figure out running the line from the potato and carrot farm all the way to the sorting system. And we'll be right back. And we're back. I've got the sorting system set up. That's right there. And I think I know how we're going to run this. I got some ice going all the way out to here. And I think we're going to keep adding some more. If, as long as we don't slide off the face of the earth. And let's get rid of that because I think that might melt the ice. Uh, we'll put it right there. So over here, dug down a hole. right to where we can feed it with the uh, dispenser system we can put in a dispenser system right there that'll spit it out into a water into a water stream going right along here and we're gonna put a soul sand there and a bunch of kelp up here to make these all water blocks in fact let's do that now what are we gonna need like 20 of them Oh, that's easy. Super easy. Okay, that ought to do it. Once they all get to the top. Well, hi. I can't seem to jump in this bay without finding one of you guys. Alright, so the idea is, you see that pipe right there? I'd like to do that again. And I think it might look good uh, coming, well, or do we want it, do we want it along the side of the building here? Where will that take us? Like if I dig down right here. You know, maybe we do that instead. We'll stick one of those. I got an axe. Why am I, why am I punching it? Yeah, let's do it that way. And then... Well, actually... Give me that. Oh yeah, this is probably a little bit dark for YouTube. Um, so we're just going to fill this all in. And hopefully I have enough. Because I did just empty out my inventory. Okay, yeah, I think we're going to have enough. And I do have a sand. There. Nothing ever happened there? I don't know what you're talking about. But these...
Yeah. I think this will look good. And then we'll kind of have the pipe going straight across here. So I'm going to get that taken care of. And we'll meet back up. Well, so we're back. We're right under the farm. You can hear him plowing away at it. And what we need to do is place one there. place one there and we're good to go this ever empties out this piston will retract it'll stop it'll stop doing the clock it's gonna be a it's gonna be a little while <laughs> all of these chests are full from me leaving it on while I was doing other things and I might have to come in here with some slabs and uh make it spawn proof because I don't want to well maybe I can get away with sticking one over here what does that make the light level over here nine let's go back one so now that light level is eight so that should still be seven up there might be okay. Nine. Yeah, I think we'll be okay. Now the question is... Did I... I didn't finish that part yet. Oh, I don't know why, but I, I thought I had that part done. <laughs> uh, do I have... Soul Sand? No, no, no. Come on. I've got to have Soul Sand. Actually, let's get rid of some of this junk. And those. I might as well toss those too. Alright, so what if... There's my toolbox. So we got one of those. definitely need well let's see let's get this part right first so if I go right there and then stick that right there Try this. Go down one and down another one and that. Maybe. Okay, that gets them there. Good, 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 good. Uh, no, not those. Yep, I definitely need to find me... Well, I threw out the stack already of uh, kelp, but I should be able to swim through these? No? I can definitely get up through this. Hello. 
Holy crap. Here, shoot your buddy. Yeah, you can you can always tell when I've been working in the area for a little while. Oh. What's what's No, no, get me out of here. Holy crap, there's still more. Let's grab what we came here for. Yeah, there we go. Coming up under him helps. Ooh, we gotta try it. Awesome. Did this? Hey. Now, unfortunately, we don't have the librarians yet to really enchant these the way we want, want to. I should have used my axe. Like that. Wow. <laughs> there was a ton of them. Alright, I don't care about the... Did you guys just, just spawn? You must have. Didn't I just... Bleh, bleh, bleh. I just went... From there to there. They weren't there. <laughs> At least water's a little bit more interesting than it used to be. Yeah, let's just go down the way we came in. Came up. Hopefully this is enough. Oh, that's right, that's right. So... Well... Give me the soul sand. There. So this should be good enough now. I should get shot right up right up to the top. There we go. And you know, I should probably get some ice down there just because. Alright, did I get the I don't know if I got the sorting system completely set up. But we're about to find out. Uh, this way. Wow, this project took a lot longer than I thought it was going to. But uh, I think it's going to be worthwhile. Yep, we got carrots right there. E. So I want potatoes for that one. Do I have any on me? No. Do I have any over here? No. Do I have any over here? One. Huh. Holy crap. All the junk. What's the other one look like? Okay, so that one's the one getting carrots. So I'll have to switch the uh, shulkers around. And... 
do a little bit of that. This double jump really does make this a lot easier. And I don't know, we might have to move this up a level. Yeah, you know what? I think we will. What we're going to do, I think, is put a water source there and a soul sand there and fill this in. Yeah, let's go grab some let's go grab some stuff. I think we can make this work. Uh, we need one more soul sand. And a bunch of hoppers. Oh, the redstone box is over there. <laughs> oh, no. What's the easiest way to get over there now? Uh, probably through the original tunnel. It's going to be nice to be done. I'm going to have to definitely put in some sort of overflow protection because this thing produces a lot more than you would expect with just the two layers actually being functional uh, a couple stacks of those all right oh yeah there's still plenty to go through and anything getting stuck here Nope. Just there. But not anymore. Yeah, we can definitely do this. Uh, I don't care if we have to make more hoppers. I'm just going to be glad to have this project over with. Because uh, it, it took a lot of planning. A lot of building. And a lot of problem shooting troubleshooting and while I enjoy the task I, I still don't want to put too much time into one episode and take away from what could be another episode okay we got that we got that uh, give me some ice and actually let me stick a piece of ice down there and fill my water bucket because I'm going to need it yeah we're gonna get this done because uh, just having the one hopper it's not enough but you know I'm really close like that's that's a grass block. So let's see. If I go to there. So if we go, uh, I wanted to grab, yeah, I wanted compact ice, but this will have to work. So let's see, that becomes water. No, no, that does not become water. So we go down there. Yeah. Although we're gonna we're gonna wanna shore up the side here. And then So we'll put the soul sand here. 
<laughs> it's just really difficult with the uh, continuing stream of carrots just jumping into my face. Alright, so we go here. There. Okay, and then we fill in that block. Let me... Oh! Oh, that is so annoying. Alright, so then... Oh. Damn torch. Alright. So we'll get rid of... No! That's exactly what I wanted to avoid doing. So let's go there and there. And there. There and there. And here. There we go. I need to replace those with compact. And then. Er, that's really annoying. to bite the bullet come down here get some real ice and I don't need all these carrots I got lots more coming I do need the potatoes though all right that there and then that there and a sign right there and there all right I think we can hide this. for now I think that could be a thing because we're gonna build a porch right here like a nice big porch for looking out at the sunset and watching the coral reef and just because it fits nicely into this little nook here no oh. freaking carrots Uh, do I have any more dirt? A little bit. I got enough of those heads. Okay, so... Alright. 
Alright, so this is not faced into the right spot. Uh, one of those. And right there. I think it's working. Uh, we don't actually need that hopper, that hopper, or that hopper. So that's got the carrots in it. Uh, what does this one have in it? Potatoes. Alright, now does that stop at 43, 41? I think it should. It does. Alright, good. Oh, well, we just heard that filled up for the first time. Awesome. So now we just need to get a bunch of shulkers going. Put them in, uh, did I put refill chests in here? Well, we will have to put them into dispensers. And uh, how are we going to set that up? I mean, technically, we could probably... So, uh, if we go there... There. There's a hopper going in. Uh, where's my chests? Back here. Yeah, I think we can pull this off. I definitely think we can pull this off. Alright, so if we stick that there. This up here. I need it to be like a stair block. do that. Alright, so there's the dispenser. We need that block gone. E. You know what, I'm just going to cut a hole through there. Yeah. There, much easier. Then I can finish this off with a pick block there. A little bit of that action. No. A no. little bit of that action. A chest. And a hopper. And I've got those to go. Nope, nope. Sym symmetrical. One, two. Yeah, I think that'll work. We can access that. We can access that. We can fill it up with colored chokers. We can change these ones to the right colors. Uh, 
we can toss those in there for now. Can't believe we got a trident just out of the blue like that. That's awesome. Let's put back all this junk. Well, what do you know? We got uh, the line all the way from the other side. It made a nice looking pipeline outside. We've got our shulker loading systems. We got the sorting system to separate them. And we've got random junk in the chest. And we're starting to get shulkers full of carrots and potatoes. All nicely sorted and over in our storage area and near our villager trader trade I think that's that's good for an episode so if you liked what you saw learned a thing or two like comment subscribe and until next episode hope everyone has a good night